Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be an Aldi's Iceland pound stretcher food haul. So I went to all three of these shops. Sometimes I do battle to get like everything in one shop that I need because we are quite a fussy family. Like although there's only three of us, like we don't all eat the same thing. So sometimes I have to go elsewhere to make sure that I'm able to get everything. But yeah, I just thought I would show you exactly what I got. It is quite a pricey week this week and I think it's just because we ran so low on everything that we just needed to restock. So hopefully we are fully restocked now and able to get on with our working week. But yeah, let me get into it and show you what we got. Oh, okay, so the first things we have is two of these packs of garden salads. The sweet and crispy salad. I just find these really easy and convenient to grab going to work and stuff like that. We got two packets of Ringos. Sophia is a firm lover of salt and vinegar Ringos, so I thought I'd grab them. As a treat, we've got some Magic Stars. This curried coconut and lime chicken slices. If you haven't tried them, you need to try them. They are absolutely divine. I got three packets of them. They are free on Slimming World. For Derek, I just got 12 garlic dough balls, two packs of them. For Sophia snacks, we've got some safari snacks. I got some of these apple and apple and grape snack packs, just a few of them. Again, just so easy and convenient to grab on the go. 10 cod fish fingers for Sophia. Yellowfin sole. This is now 10 cents per box. So five per slice, but they're absolutely delicious. I like to have them like on a kind of treat day. So yeah, I thought I'd grab them. This is all for Derek's work. We've got some chocolate breaks, some caramel wafer bars, and some chocolate wafer bars. Over here I'm doing pork loin, so I've got some pork loin steaks, four of them so I'll just cut the fat off and they are completely free. I've got some butternut squash to go with this. Over here we've got some potato croquettes, some chicken nuggets for Sophia again, some wee willy winkies and then over here I've got some mushroom stir fry. Okay and we've got some snacky bits from Aldi's, we've got two of these bacon rashers some milky bar buttons, some brioche rolls, some sweet popcorn which I'm going to divide up into little bags as a snack for Sophia, some plain bagels for Derek and we've got two bags of these easy peelers, a tin of small new potatoes, these are absolutely phenomenal and then we've got two milks each, one two semi skimmed and two skimmed which is what I use and then we've got five bananas also we got two packs of gala apples which Derek's decanted already so yeah I thought I'd include them as well and the total of that shop came to 46 pounds and 70 pence okay and then from Iceland I grabbed a pack of Greg sausage rolls these are for Derek for work I thought they would be quite handy got some Slimming World chunky chips I know this is a hit or a miss with some people, but for me it's just easy and convenient. And then we've got three packs of smoked sausage for Derek. They were on it a pound, so I just grabbed them when they are on special. And then last but not least, I got four of these sin free beef quarter pounder quarter, quarter pounders. These are some of friendly, obviously. And I just think again for easy convenience, it means I can do them at night time for work the next day. And it's a nice, like healthy kind of filling meal. And the total of that came to £14.04. Sorry, last but not least, this was from Pound Stretcher. And I got two of these oyster sauces. These are free on Summer World and this is what I use for my stir fry. Got a big packet of penguin biscuits for Derek's work. Again, some pink wafers for Derek. Apparently, Sophia likes these and she decided she would just put them in the trolley. So yeah, some of them. And then these are the equivalent to Oreos but so much cheaper and so much better value because there's actually 10 little packs inside um, and it just means that she's not wasting an awful lot. The total of that came to £12.68. So I just thought I would show you exactly what we've got in the meal planner this week. This little meal planner pad is magnetic and I got it from Poundland and it's so so good, so handy. So for Monday, as you can see, we have for breakfast fruit or wheat bits. I kind of switch between the two. If I know that I'm going to be having healthy extra beet at the end of the night, then I'll just stick to fruit. For lunch, for lunch I'm having burgers and salad, and for dinner stir fry. 
Tuesday. Basically, the breakfasts are all the same Monday to Friday, apart from Saturday and Sunday when I have a cooked breakfast. Just like to fill up and make sure that I'm getting the best that I can and it stops me from snacking during the day. And then back to Tuesday, we have stir fry because I will have leftovers from the dinner before. And dinner is chicken curry and rice. And the reason I'm saying this is because I have a load of um, frozen chicken curry in our um, freezer that I need to use up. So I thought I would try and get in as many as I can. For lunch on Wednesday, it's a freezer meal. Again, I've got so much there that I really need to start using them. And for dinner, I'm having a baked potato and salad. And on the baked potato, I will just have beans and one of the Philadelphia lights. Thursday is a freezing meal, Friday is a freezing meal. For dinner on Thursday I'm having pork loin and veg. For dinner on Friday I'm having some little pizza slash fake away. Um, again I do have some curry in the freezer which I might use up and make some salt and pepper chips. And then on Saturday I'm having a subway salad for lunch. Although I think that might be scrapped because I'm going out for lunch. And then at night time I'm having burger and salad. And then on Sunday it's just blank because that is normally when I do my food shop. So I will decide then what I'm going to have. Okay, so that was everything from this week's shopping haul. I hope you've enjoyed this. Please remember and give it a big thumbs up and hit the subscribe button down below. And yeah, I will see you all later. Bye!